Good evening, folks. <clears throat> Today we're going to do a run through on how to set up a fire stick from beginning to end. Load it with the Hotbox Media Center and get all the best apps available in under 15 minutes. Anybody can do it, so uh, let's run through it. So, first you go to settings, come over to device. Click on device, go to developer options, turn on ADB debugging, turn on apps from unknown sources, and that's it, home button. Now that we're back in the home screen, you press the little microphone button at the top of your remote. Downloader. And you will get the downloader app, which is the orange one with the white arrow. Click on that. And download it. Open it. Hit OK for this. And now, right here where it says enter URL of the website you want to load or the file you want to download. And you see the HTTP colon forward slash forward slash already populated. Click on that. Hit B I T dot L Y forward slash H B M C six one nine. That's it. B I T dot L Y forward slash H B M C six one nine and hit go. Just that easy. It will automatically download the Hotbox Media Center for you. Wait for it to download. Go to install. Install the Hotbox Media Center. Once it's installed, hit open. Once it opens, it's going to have you enter your email address so it can send you a PIN number. You must put your proper email address. Gmail addresses work quick, quicker. But here you put your email address in. I'm going to pause the video while I put mine in. So I received my PIN and it is 7037 and next and then hit activate. Once you do that, you are now inside the Hotbox Media Center and you can see the movies on demand, TV shows on demand, and the live TV. Anything that says premium is a subscription service. Anything that says free is free for you. So we're gonna to go to the Hotbox Gold app, click on that. You go down to member login um, here you can also do in-app payments. So you make your payment here, one month or 12 months. Once you make your payment, you go down to member login. If you've already made your payment, just go to member login. Don't click on these. Go down to the member login. Click on that. And as you can see, it automatically starts downloading. So anything that's connected to these tiles, if you don't already have it on your box, it will download it for you. As simple as that. So it downloaded the Hotbox Gold app. We will now install it. And while that's installing, I'm going to download the movies on demand. All you have to do is wait for it to download and click install. 
It's just that simple, people. Every tile you click on, if the app is not already on your device, it will download the app for you. The good thing about this media center is that it's dynamic. So all the tiles have an app connected to them. If we change the app that's connected to that tile, then it'll automatically download the new app for you. Now here, it's asking for my username and password. Once you make payment, you will receive a username and password in which to log in with. I'm going to pause this and put my username and password in. Be right back. So I entered my username and password, and now I log in. It's going to download the channels, and we'll wait for that. The movies and TV shows inside of here do not work, people. Don't try to use them. They don't work. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to install the TV Guide. Next, I'm going to go into the settings and make some changes that I prefer. General settings. I don't want the app to start up every time I boot my fire stick, so I'm turning that off. I also don't like military time, so I'm going to change it to 12 hour format. And lastly, I go to EPG Timeline and only show channels that have a TV guide attached to them. So that's all the settings. So now I will go to the live TV. And here you have it folks. All of your live TV will go to USA channels. I have the volume turned down, but there you go. And let me go ahead and click on that for you just to show you what it looks like. Pay-per-view, of course, it has to be live. We'll go to USA Premium Channels. And there goes your Cinemax. And we'll go ahead and get out of TV Guide. USA Channels. And there's your TV guy. All right, enough of that. Now we'll go back to the movies on demand that I've already downloaded. And once again, settings first. Autoplay. Click on autoplay and enable autoplay for movies and TV shows. I prefer autoplay. You can bypass that if you want. Subtitles. I do not like subtitles. I'm not hearing impaired. I turn subtitles off. It's completely up to you. And then you have your movies and TV shows. I'm sure most of you are familiar with Morpheus and these apps, so I won't go too in depth with that. Um, we'll do one more. TV shows on demand. Go ahead and download that. And install it. While that's installing, I will run past our support. Here you have our support. It will take you to where you can put a ticket in. We will have helpful videos, um, tips and tricks, whatever. And right here I want to support and I can go to open a ticket. And if I'm having any issues, I can submit a ticket and one of the Hotbox staff members will answer that ticket. Um, we also have games. So all your retro gaming is in here. From Atari all the way up to PlayStation. There's over 3,000 games that you can download and enjoy. I'm going to go ahead and install that real quickly. And we'll hit install. Now we'll go back to the TV shows that I just installed, downloaded and installed. And there's a new version. I'm not going to update right now for the sake of time. Skip down all this, hit OK. Now. One thing I want to mention, as you see, it's defaulting 
to movies. Come right here to the top. You'll see the three lines on the top left hand corner, what they call the hamburger menu. Click on that and go to TV shows and it will default to TV shows. All the apps have that menu and the option of changing from movies to TV shows or vice versa. Don't so take advantage of that. And go ahead and get out of there. It's pretty self-explanatory. And go to the game section. So these are your gaming section. You do need a Bluetooth controller in order to play, of course. And here you go. PlayStation, Nintendo 64, Yaza Yaza Ya. So, say for instance you want to play Mario Brothers. Click on it. Click download. Gonna, click download. It's going to take. Okay, we seem to be having errors. Um, issues with our video games right now. And then launch. Launch again. And there you go. Super Mario World on your big screen. Enough of that, and I'm out of here. Um, that's pretty much it, folks. Hotbox Plus is our backup IPTV service. So for the $15 a month, you get Hotbox Gold and Hotbox Plus as a backup. So you have built-in IPTV service as a backup um, that's pretty much it that's how easy it is to use the Hotbox Media Center and download some of the best apps available thank you and have a good night